have some unfinished business, and I think you know what it is. It's the cheater and the unswirl. Over this season, these two fans have risen to the top, the newcomer being the unswirl and the OG being the cheater, which is a holdover from season three. In the last fan showdown episode, I made the comment that the cheater is yet to be defeated, and some of you aggressively disagreed with that. And the reason being that in my F Elson V400 review, I 3D printed some TPU gaskets and put them on the unswirl. And with those gaskets, it was able to outperform the cheater. However, I didn't count it since that's not how the, the fan was sent to me. And I just left the cheater in first place and it's driven a rift within the community. So today's the day we find out truly which one of these fans is the best, and then that fan will move to season five. I have seen a few comments over the last, fan, last few fan showdowns saying that a lot of you want to go back to cooling rather than flow testing. So I'll leave it up to you to decide if we do air cooling or water cooling. Uh, do you have a specific air cooler or AIO, or do you want to go custom loop? Leave me a comment down below for what setup you want to see in the you know, the fan showed on season five. If you have a specific cooler in mind that you wanna see, let me know. I'm gonna browse through the comments down there and I'll post a community poll for you to vote on, you know, what we do for season five. So if you don't mind, uh, subscribe to the channel so you can vote on that poll and then we will set off back to cooling. So for this head to head, I did purchase two brand new A12 X25s. Um, I only need one really, but I purchased two because I want the uh, anti-vibration gasket. We'll get to that in a minute. But here are two brand new fans that we're gonna use as our test bench for this head to head. We're gonna try to make everything as apples to apples as possible. I reprinted both fans with the same material on the same printer with the same settings. We're gonna use them on the same fan and we're gonna use the gaskets that are included with these Noctua fans on both the front and the back of the fan to give them the best possible chance of putting out maximum maximum power and I will use those gaskets moving forward in season five. Now the first step obviously is going to be taking one of these fans and destroying it and if you're curious to how do I do this if you want to like buy your own A12X25 and test your fan design out at home I'll show you what I think is the easiest process for taking this fan hub off. Now I've used many different ways to remove this fan over uh, the, the last year or so from Dremels to clippers to side cuts but I think the easiest way to do it is to use a soldering iron and a tip that you don't mind messing up. I normally set my soldering iron to the, the, highest, the hottest possible setting and then in a well ventilated area, I kind of melt the hub into quarters. You can also break the blades off if you want. I normally do, this just makes it easier to handle things. And after the blades are removed, I continue melting down the, the side of the fan all the way through. And then using like a pick or some flush cutters, I remove the surface plastic from the top of the, the fan hub. After that, and everything's all divided up, you can just use a pick to just kind of pop the, the each individual quarter off, and they kind of come off pretty easily. And the last thing I normally do is run an edge around the top of the, the metal hub and kind of remove that last little bit of adhesive, and doing that just makes it easier to slide your fan off and on. So now that we have our brand new test bench, along with the beautiful anti-vibration gaskets, let's find out how these two fans did and who gets the W. The cheater peaked at 776 feet per minute and the unswirl peaked at 768 feet per minute. Meaning that with everything as equal as I possibly can make it with the, with the equipment I have, the cheater remains in first place by the slimmest of margins. So because of that, the cheater will move forward onto season five and I'll be retesting it along with four new fans in the upcoming new season. In whatever setup you guys decide we're gonna use, air cooling, water cooling, custom loop, AIO, specific air cooler, specific water cooler. It's up to you. So go down in the comment section. Let me know what you think for season five. Hope you enjoyed the video. I'll see you next time.